Today, nationwide strike has begun. The central strike has quite been successful on Tuesday. All the main central government establishments as well as nationalized banks were closed, besides some local industries too. And on Wednesday is Goa Ban. No private buses, rickshaws and motorcycle pilots, only Kadamba buses and taxis. The impact of the general strike was seen in many cities as well as industrial estates. Besides nationalized banks, central government establishments like post offices and BSNL workers were also on strike. To protest against the price hike, unemployment and several other issues of livelihood, thousands of workers gathered at the Azad Maidan in Banaji. <laughs> GST one tax One nation one tax. In South Goa, capital of Margao, uh, pharmacies were also closed besides bank and post offices. The pharmacists joined the strike to protest against the online sale of drugs. Online pharmacy illegal Government draft rule wrong habit forming drugs The state machinery has geared up to face the Goa Ban on Wednesday. The daily commuters would mainly hit because there would be no private buses, rickshaws and pilot motorcycle pilots on the road. The Kadamba Transport Corporation is pressing more buses into services on several routes. Congress has also supported the Goa Band. Congress Paksha Tencha Sagreja Maganagadin San Butiasa Ani Jatarin Modi Sarkaran Sagreya Lokam Fodila. Tashets had trade union and we've sagra for Dela Saga Palace Sagrad Bank Sagra Institution eggs on Bandas of Kalkin Lasa. They are Kola Go Pradesh Congress Committee support Gata. Amjay Fala Bandasa, the Banda Amjay, honorable chairman of Kangala Pramari Ami, Sagri Amjay Tari Kilasa, and about four eighty five buses from Joe on the road asa, Joe Ami Fala Pushkurtale. Plus, interstate cardio jata, the other Samda, Fala operations, Tanja Bandas, I Bandas Tanja operation, but Falazar Bandas Lala, Mithio cardio jata, to border for insol and Magil, the local route and Solova, uh, Survat Kurtale. Our reporters Ramesh Naikraut in Margao and video journalist Yeshwan Parap in Panachi.